welcome back to another episode with me, Living Free Ashley. Today we are making air fried bacon wrapped asparagus, vegan gluten free style of course, you heard that right. <laughs> we are not using any faux meats or any anything specialty that you have to go to like a specialty store to buy. We're just using rice paper sheets and a bunch of spices, an air fryer and asparagus. So this is my first recipe with my new air fryer. I was always contemplating getting an air fryer, but I just never pulled the trigger until I kept seeing all of these YouTube videos and these vegan YouTubers making these amazing things in air fryers. Uh, check out Live Life Lori, she does a lot in her air fryer and she just comes up with these really cool combinations. So if you wanna see more vegan, mostly gluten-free air fryer recipes, check her out. But anyways, I finally pulled the trigger and bought an air fryer and I freaking love it. It's changed my life. It's amazing in the summer when it's super hot out and I use it pretty much daily. So if you're on the fence about getting one, just get one. <laughs> and if you don't have an air fryer, you can always put it in the oven. So let's get cooking. Okay, the first thing is to get a shallow bowl and add two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil, three tablespoons of gluten-free tamari or soy sauce, three tablespoons of nutritional yeast, a half a teaspoon of liquid smoke, this is essential, half a tablespoon of pure maple syrup, and a pinch of black pepper. And you just wanna whisk that all together until it's well combined and then set aside. Next, you wanna get two rice paper sheets and put them together and cut into thin strips. Now, as you can see, my strips were breaking quite a bit. And after I had filmed this video, I went and saw Live Life Lori's crispy vegan bacon. And what she did is she put two of the sheets together wet them and then cut them into strips and that seemed to work a lot better. So definitely do as Lori did. <laughs> okay, so once you have all of your strips cut, you wanna get your setup. So you wanna have your air fryer bowl, give that a little bit of oil just so there's no sticking. And then you have your asparagus, your shallow bowl with your marinade, and then a shallow bowl of water. Now, if you did Lori's version of cutting the strips, you can skip this next step and just go right to the marinade. But if you did it my way, then you take two of the strips and put them together, soak it in water, then soak it in the marinade, and then wrap the asparagus and put it into the air fryer bowl. Another thing that I found really helpful is putting the strips together, soaking them in water, and then leaving them on the counter to soften a little bit before you marinate. It just wrapped around the asparagus a little bit easier. But again, if you're using Lori's method, you don't have to do this because they've already started softening. So once your air fryer basket is full, then you pop it in the air fryer at 375 for about 10 minutes until they are nice and crispy. I took mine out with three minutes to go, but I actually could have left it in a little bit longer. And because every air fryer is a little different, you just want to keep checking on them until they are done to the crispiness that you prefer. How cool and tasty does that look? Mm, so good. Super cool. Am I right? <laughs> Everybody knows that I used to eat meat and I did like an occasional bacon wrapped asparagus and now I feel like I can finally get the gluten free vegan version of it and it's still fairly healthy. So thank you again for watching another episode with me, Living Free Ashley. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and cheers to living free.